I feel like I'm losing my mind Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign A sign I feel like I'm losing my mind Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign A sign I wanna be the greatest Everybody on the face shit I look around and feel like everybody Face it, face but face it I'm a face it, face but face it I'm a What's going on dudes? I know I've been gone for a while, haven't posted any videos. I've uh, been dealing with some stuff at the house, stuff with my daughter, she started school. I uh, had some unexpected bills pop up, so I haven't had the money to do anything. Been working six days a week, but I got some stuff going on now, so I'm about to be posting some more videos and then I'm gonna hit up some more shows and gonna be going to the drag races and getting some footage of some race cars. Trying to do a couple features, so I'll be back at it. Just had to take a little bit of time off. Uh, I'm about to, here, let me show y'all. I haven't had the money to do anything, so what I plan on doing, I'm about to cut some wood and shrink this port and tune it a little lower. It's tuned at like 30, ow, oh, shit. It's tuned at like 32 now. So what I plan on doing, I'm gonna add two inches to each side. I'm gonna cut some strips and uh, flare them out a little bit, but I'll cut some strips that go all the way through the port. That's gonna shrink the port from 133 square inches to I think 112 square inches. And this should drop the tuning down to about 29 maybe a little bit lower. So I'm gonna do that. We'll cut that up, put it in the box, try that, see how it sounds. And then sometime this weekend, I'm probably gonna go ahead and order a 390 amp alternator from AutoTech. Right now, the one I'm running is like 150, 160 amps, not worth a shit. So we're gonna bump it up with pretty much over twice what it's running now. I was gonna order the lithium and do a good size lithium bank. I was gonna do like a 64 amp hour. But if I do that, I might as well just buy the alternator. I think the alternator is gonna, gonna gain a lot more than the lithium. And it just seems like it makes sense to do the alternator first. So I'm gonna get the lime green, pretty much 400 amp alternator. And we'll hook that up. Still only going to be able to get the power that these amps put out. But at least it's going to be clean and it's going to stay up in the 14s. Because right now, on a low note, it drops all the way down to 10.9. So, say 11 volts to 14, I'm gaining 3 full volts. I should add a good, I'm guessing, 200 to 400 watts clean power. So we'll get the box retuned, then we'll get the alternator, put it on, see the difference. We'll clamp it, check the power difference, and then I'll be ready to get a bigger amp. Once I get a 5K or an 8K, this thing should be slamming. All right, let's get it. All right, so this is how I'm doing this. I'm cutting these. Uh, they're an inch and a quarter thick. And then they'll go down on the edge like that. I'll screw them to the edge. That way I can take them back out if I want. I can come pop a couple screws out, slide them back out to tune it higher. But I'm gonna have one of these and then a three quarter inch mounted to this one. So that'll be two inches on each side. And that should drop it from 133 to I think 112 or 110 and lower the tuning three hertz. All right, so here's what I made. One of these are gonna go in each side. I'm gonna sand this down and probably flush that. 
and then I'll screw it from the side and then I got another one that's gonna go down in this corner and that's gonna cut out I think four inches of the port and then I got two more that I got to go in inside the box and do through the bottom and hopefully that'll work out pretty good then we'll see what it sounds like being tuned lower should sound pretty good all right so i got everything rounded over good so the air should flow nice and smooth i'm gonna throw a 45 in the bottom of the port where it uh where it does a 45 and yeah we're gonna throw some paint on these things make them green and then we'll take the box out slide them down in the box screw them in we'll see what it sounds like all right we got them painted these are the only two that you're going to see these are going to be on the top those will be inside the box so we got the ones painted that we need to that way it's not going to look like pure dog shit. all right let's get them in <clears throat> see how it sounds so that's how it's going to look nice and curved so air can roll out i'll have one in that other corner and that should tune it lower Nothing like some good old. <laughs> That's like that drilling. It's got some good old sheetrock screws. You yep, know? you sure are drilling with the drill. Yep, that's right. People say don't use sheetrock screws, but Daddy uses sheetrock screws. Sheetrock screws? Yeah. Cheap and effective. I see you, and I think I can see you too. Right, take the speaker out. Yep. Maybe. It's kind of stuck. I think I need a screwdriver. What's up, little lady? I'm your photographer. What's up, YouTube? A camera girl is a photographer, so I'm the photographer. Gotta get your kids into the car audio early. Five years old seems early enough. Eighteen, baby. All right, so now when we get the box out, we'll do the same thing we did up here. But we'll slide it in on the bottoms and then screw it all in. We'll be good to go. All right, gentlemen, we are done. Let's see if I can get a good video of that. So I slid these down, screwed them from the outside, and then I did the ones on the bottom. Then I went 
and I also went ahead and threw a 45 in the bottom in the corner down there so yeah that 45 down there should help a little bit and the box will be tuned lower so we're gonna see what it sounds like and hopefully meter it once I get some time to meet up with my boys that's got the meter and we'll see where it peaks at and see if it's any louder than it was I doubt it's gonna be louder because it was peaking at like 39 40 it's probably gonna peak around 36 37 now but hey you never know my car might like it so let's get it in I gotta get back to the house so my old lady can go to work so let's get a quick uh, first first impression See how it sounds. Okay. AK knocking out you like timber. Get your baby mom for the benders. Get the wish and I defend you. You and I spoke my tender. Don't like that. It's a right. Bobbing and tumbling. Easy hands. Me and I still take kids. Take a plug off in a minute. Just ran a whole block. Give it a hell. Fuck a nigga bitch. I'm a gentleman. Turn on your bitch. No, I beat a man. Playing with the rock like a gentleman. Definitely sounds better. Hits a little bit lower. I think they're shrinking the port, not even tuning it lower. I think the shrinking the port made it made it sound a little better. It just feels more solid. It seemed like it might have been a little bit louder the other way. I'm not sure, but it's definitely moving more air and shaking everything more. I just have to spend a little bit of time on it. The voltage is dropping a little bit more now. I'm sure the impedance rise is a little bit a little bit different now too that it's got a little bit more restriction to the port yeah we'll spend a little time with it i'll get a video on the outside of it tomorrow and post another video peace